Hey everyone, how's it going? I'm Casey Martin from Wine Country Woodworks and this is going to be a new shop episode. I've got a bunch of cool new stuff going on. I've got some crazy big blocks I wanna show you guys, like three inches square by 10 inches long, and then uh, a ton and a ton of new blocks, like about 115, 120 or so. So anyway, um, I'll show you guys kind of them from the stack. I'm not gonna go through all of them individually, but and some other cool new updates. So let's get right into it. So here is the big box of blocks heading out to, box of blocks, <laughs> heading out to a customer um, who's gonna be turning um, some really cool things out of these. And um, a lot of them, as you can see, are like the gold leaf, the silver leaf, and the copper leaf. Um, some of them are pearl ones. These are all the three inch square by seven inch sizes. Um, but down below, if we can go through the piles, there are some 10 inch long ones down there. I um, probably should have showed you guys them all before I, I stacked them all in here, but some really, really cool ones. Basically the, the smaller versions are just replicated in the larger ones. So these should look really, really cool once turned. I'll show you guys a clip of these smaller ones um, that glow in the dark and they look really, really cool. So I'll, I'll throw that clip in there. So got a lot of cool stuff to show you guys over here, mainly the blocks. Um, I think in all of these that I recently cut up and marked and everything, it went up to like 115 or 14, something like that. And then I have 40 or so that are um, up in the house. But this is also a big, big new piece of maple burl I got. I obviously use a ton of wood and all of these blocks. I've still got quite a bit left over here in this general area, but definitely needed some more maple. I got these from the guys over at OregonBurls.com. Um, you can contact them and, and order large pieces like this if you, if you email them. Um, but like I said, I'm not gonna go through all of these and the oil finish that I used to take photos has has dried so they don't look as as good as when I took the pictures and all of that, but some really, really cool ones in here nonetheless. Um, so these will be up on Etsy over the next week or two. I'm about to go on a vacation um, visiting family, really. So um, anyway, look for these if you're interested in any of them coming up soon. Cool things I wanted to show you guys was that I'm gonna start doing more color swirl, um, all resin blocks and pen blinks. I haven't really done these in the past. I mean, obviously I make quite a bit of hybrids with color swirls, but not all resin ones. And I think this will be really, really cool for stuff because you'll you know have the opaque benefit of resin um, when you're turning like a thin pen or, or things like that. And they're also really fun to make and just look really, really cool. So yeah, these will be up for sale too uh, if you're interested in those. So another thing I wanted to mention, um, two things. One, really exciting, two, not so much. The first is that I got a really, really nice, cool new camera that I'm gonna be using to film the videos. It's getting delivered any day now. Um, it's a Sony A6400 for any of you guys who are into cameras and are curious. Um, so I'm really excited to start using that. It's gonna be um, a big game changer, kind of upgrade the video quality, so that should be fun. The other thing is that I'm starting my MBA program really, really soon in about a couple of weeks um, or three weeks or so. August 15th is when the program starts. And for basically the first month until the normal school starts around September 18th at Cal Poly, um, it's gonna be six hours a day, Monday through Friday. So the channel is gonna take a big hit, obviously, as well as the shop. So I'm not gonna be making as many videos and, and as many things to update you guys with and make videos of. So um, bear with me, I'll still try to do as much as I can, but obviously, you know, school and uh, getting a job is in is a higher priority, but want to update you guys on that. It should be fun, but it's obviously gonna be a lot of work. So want to give you guys a heads up nonetheless. 
So even though I have a ton of cool blocks made, as you guys saw, I'm still gonna continue to try to make absolutely as many as I can before um, I go back to school. And it's it's also a good thing for me to do when I do have free time because um, there's you know no no recipe to follow, nothing um, special I have to worry about. However, the block comes out, it comes out. So um, I just wanted to show you guys some of some of these cool ones. I thought I had more pieces in here sanded. Um, there's these two over here. So I know this one is pretty cool. I think I did black first actually, and then did like red and purple. And then this one, I just did black. And black's really, really hard to get. I, I can feel that it's heavy, so it, it's, it stabilized well, but I'm not sure if I'm gonna do another color or not I might but might just stick with brown or kind of or black but more kind of a, a gray brown but yeah so if you guys are curious about how I do this I have a video on it if you haven't seen that but um I think that's about it for this episode all right everyone well I think that's about it for this episode uh I have been up to a lot and I felt like I had a lot to share but as I was kind of going around the shop, you know, thinking of the updates and showing you guys the updates, I kind of realized a lot of it was stuff that I've already sent out, you know, blocks and, and stuff like that, like for instance, and um, if I can find the video, I'll, I'll throw it up. As I'm talking, I made a, a shark tooth pen that for a lady who had a, um, she makes calligraphy pens and she had a customer send in a shark tooth. And so I resin cast that on some live edge maple burl, kind of as an ocean floor with a blue transparent resin that looked really cool. Um, I did my first kind of tube in casting with snake skin for um, a buddy, uh, which was pretty fun. And then, um, you know, all those blocks I was showing you guys about. So anyway, that's, that's enough for me from now. If you're new to the channel and wanna stick around and see more cool stuff, please subscribe, like the video if you liked it. And, uh, Please also feel free to comment down below anything, of course, but also please let me know of any video ideas that you guys would like to see, video topics. I always love to see that and um, we'll get one of those coming up soon that you guys suggest. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.